Hello. Let's look at difference of two non-consecutive triangle number. These are two triangle number. They are non-consecutive. J minus uh, T uh, I minus one. This is the J triangular number, and the, this is I minus one triangle number. J greater than I greater than equal to two. We're gonna show that when you add this up, it's equal to the difference of two non-consecutive triangle number. We're gonna start uh, before that. Let us remind ourselves what a triangle number. The k triangle number is when you sum one plus two plus three all the way to plus k, and this can be uh, this sum can be you can get this sum from k the number of terms there by two times first term plus the last term k will get you the sum. Or k triangle number is given by that. Now we're gonna start from here. Show that it's equal to the right hand side. Now we have i, i plus 1, plus i plus 2, dot 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 2, j. So we observe uh, this is the first term, second term, third term. This is what term? Let us call this term the k term. So we want to know what k is, how many, uh, what is the value of that? Notice that j, you can get j starting from i, and notice that uh, at second term you add one third term you add three the the k term you need to add k minus one okay times one actually you know because uh sorry i plus k minus one okay now k is given by isolate k and then these two goes to the uh, left it will be j minus i plus one so k so this is the j minus i plus one term so they are j minus i plus one term so it'll be one two three four five and then this is the j minus i plus one term so so this is the j plus i minus one term therefore the value of this when you sum them uh, uh since this is a a piece first term is i common difference is one uh is given by the number of terms as just now you, we, we mentioned that they are j minus i plus one term divided by two first value of the uh, first term is i the last value of the last term is j so when you uh, have j minus i plus one number of terms divided by two times the first term plus the last term this will get you the value of the sum now let us distribute that i j minus j sorry uh, let's do this j i minus i square plus j done with that let's do this j j minus i j plus j i j i j cancel one is positive one negative then we're left with that and then uh, j j put it here uh, plus one j here plus minus i square here plus i uh, you can write this as two sum this divided by two and then this divided by two factor out the j you get j for this one plus one factor out the minus i you get i for this one minus one for that and uh, this piece is uh, just write one plus j this one uh, you can write this i uh, i minus one is this and you can write this i as i minus one plus one notice that this is number of terms first term plus the last term divided by two this is the j triangle number whereas this one is the number of terms is i minus two uh, sorry i minus one divided by two uh, first term is one and then uh, the last value of the uh, term is i minus one and this is the i minus one triangle number this is what we, we want done thank you for watching hope video is informative helpful before you go, make sure you subscribe, share, comment, and don't forget to hit or smash the like button. See you.